angel fly within my life beside me in all I do. Hi beautiful people, I'm Anna Grace Taylor and welcome to your weekly angel reading for November 15th through to the 21st. I'm going to be using the Angel Wisdom Tarot Cards by Radley Valentine. So let's see what the angels have to say, first of all, for Monday and Tuesday. Ooh, love this card as we begin the week. It's the Six of Fire, Victory, Wise Choices That Bring Public Recognition and Success, Promotions, Awards or Scholarships. So this is usually great news around our career or work life, but this is also just reasons to celebrate, doing really, really well, acknowledging yourself, being acknowledged for how far you've come, the beautiful ways that you make a difference, so keep your heart open to receiving good news as you begin the week because this is a lovely, lovely energy of celebration. Okay, gorgeous card. Oh, wow. So the card for the middle of the week definitely suggests that this is an opportunity of some kind because it says, um, one of fire, an amazing opportunity. Be bold, courageous, and optimistic. Now is the time to take action. Do what you're passionate about. So this does suggest, especially because of the six of fire, that we're going to be given an opportunity and to remember that we can confidently say yes because this is gonna bring us all blessings, everyone involved, and it's something that we're absolutely ready and capable for. So we have to put ourselves forward and know that we can absolutely do it okay gorgeous and as we come into the end of the week again another one uh, one of earth this time so this does suggest it's a new blessing a new opportunity but this is also gorgeous and it's again focusing on our career it says a windfall of abundance wise counsel or good fortune an exciting career opportunity a lucrative contract significant purchases like a home or vehicle so this could be a personal purchase as well but what it feels like to me is that we're able to do that because of the blessings that we have received previously or that we're about to receive that she's walking her own path she's perhaps walking a new path but this is something that is going to be abundant and prosperous in all ways gorgeous gorgeous energy very very similar messages this week a real theme running through it we have a full moon it's eclipse season um, and we have a full moon coming up I believe it's in Taurus on Friday and again this is very much about our earthly needs being met so again releasing any fear any doubt any procrastination around those things and fully receiving the abundance and opportunities given to us right now because they are full of blessings okay so Let's see what the message from my book is, Messages of Grace, 111 Notes of Love and Guidance from Your Angels. For those of you who don't know, um, I announced on um, Saturday that I am opening up orders for signed copies of these books that will be sent directly from me to you. So if you would like your signed copy for yourself or a loved one, I'll pop the link below. Orders are just open to this Saturday, so for a week only, and I will be posting out orders on the 29th of November. So do allow time for delivery, especially if you're outside the UK, but these do make great holiday gifts, okay? So let's see what the message is for... Uh, this week, it's number 60, the source of your happiness. You are indeed a powerful divine being with the ability to create your own experience. Do not give your power away to others by seeing them as the source of your happiness or unhappiness, abundance or lack. Instead, choose your own reactions, make your own decisions and live the life you desire. There is only one you. So that says to me that 
whatever opportunities that you get this week, whatever you're being offered, remember that they're not the source of anything that's going to really give you peace and happiness. They can for sure add to it. But whether or not you say yes to this, whether or not that it's really meant for you, you can really connect with the well of abundance within you, the well of peace within you, so that no matter what happens, you feel taken care of. Okay, so looking forward to a magical, abundant week. I'll be sharing the daily angel messages on my Facebook and Instagram. In the meantime, sending you lots of love. Bye-bye.